Okay, so this video is going to be a quickie video on how to remove uh, the battery box and other parts uh, so that you can gain access to the transmission control module, the TCM for a Mazda 5. This will be good for 2006 to 2010 type models. Um, so first thing you're going to want to do is remove um, the battery cover. Then you'll want to remove um, the ventilation duct to keep the battery that keeps the battery cool. Um, after that, you're going to want to remove the top half of the air cleaner assembly. So that comes off like that. Um, the air cleaner assembly has four clips that you'll have to undo, all four of them, in order to remove that. Also, um, there's a pipe that plugs into the top of the air of the thing of the air box, and there's also a um, connector, a connector that plugs into uh, the sensor on top of the air box. So after you get that out of the way, then you can remove this uh, battery box. First take the face front cover off. Um, at this point you would remove this bracket, which would be holding the battery in. Then you'll lift the battery out, which I've already done because I uh, took this apart previously to get the TCM out. Move the wires out of the way. Then this box is going to lift out after you remove two 10 bolt 10 millimeter bolts that hold the box in the 10, two, 10 millimeter bolts go into this hole and to this hole okay so now this will um after i remove the cover to the c computer this is where the engine computer is right there remove that cover take the box and computer out after you've unplugged the two connectors there's two connectors that plug into the computer just lift out the computer and box as as all one unit got to clear the um got to clear the wires there we go so that just steps out and you can see I've already mounted the TCM uh, so that it's dangling off the line so that it's not gonna be in as direct a heat as uh, with the uh, transmission as it normally would here floating around it should get much better airflow originally this unit tucked in under this uh, under this bracket here and there's uh, three bolts that hold the TCM in place as you can see the TCM has three mounting holes um, so you, you remove it and uh, you disconnect this connector here and the connector will be pointing in in this direction it plugs in like this disconnect that and rem remove the three fasteners and it comes out so that's basically how you get to the TCM on these cars.